Hello, my name is Shireen Johnson and I am an international student from Jamaica. Today I'll be preparing for you the authentic Jamaican curry chicken. Now I'm going to get the ingredients. Next time you hear my voice is when I'm in the kitchen cooking up a storm. Alright, so this is the next stage of the curry chicken. Now, see that the water that was generated, I'm going to show you this, you see how that looked like? Uh, you see that it was um, simmered, most of the water is already gone. So the chicken already get that nice flavor because the chicken was cooked on it in you know, somewhat steam by itself. Right, so the, the small amount of water left in this pot. So what we're going to do, I don't have any carrot because as I said, I'm cooking my my Sunday dinner. So whatever is in my fridge, that is what is going on this for a chicken right now. Alright, so the water, so I have, alright, so right in this pot. Okay, so right in this pot here now is the chicken I'm adding my pepper. See the, the scotch bonnet pepper right there. As I said, I'm out of carrots. I'm cooking my Jamaican dinner um, curry. So whatever is in my kitchen, that is what I'm using today. Still gonna taste good even if I don't have carrot. That's okay. See the scotch bonnet. I put about three small pieces of scotch bonnet pepper. It depends on how you like the spiciness of the curry. Me, I don't really like it too spicy. So now I'm putting in the the uh, the Irish potato and he, those first thing is some fresh scallion I put right there so what I'm going to do next um, I'm gonna leave this again to steam down but this time I'm just gonna add a little bit of water just a little bit rinsing out the pan we don't want anything to waste so see I'm rinsing out just using a little bit of water just to rinse out the remaining seasoning in the pan we don't want anything to go to waste so that is all I am going to do. See, a little bit of water. Put this in side of the pot. And we are going to let this cook down. As I said, and I'm doing everything on that medium heat. So I'm gonna let the Irish cook. See, enough water is there to cook the Irish. Cause I just had a little bit. You don't wanna have too much water. Take, take away the flavor from the curry. And from the chicken, you don't want to have too much. Mm -mm. Don't have too much water in this thing here. Put it on medium heat, not too high, because if you turn the, the if you turn the heat up too high, it's gonna really dry out the chicken fast, and it's not gonna cook. It's going to burn. So you want to put it on medium heat and let this thing cook down. And you're gonna see the next, and you're gonna see the final run. I'm gonna show you the final run. So it has enough water, as I said, just a little bit of water. You rinse out the pan that you seize up your meat in. Pour that in the pot, you know, now this time as I said, and I'm going to let this simmer under medium heat until it is finished cooking and it is ready to go with my rice and peas and vegetable and blended juice. I'm telling you, real Jamaican style up in here. Okay, stay tuned. Okay, so here's the final run of the curry. Steam down, as I said, on medium heat. And we're gonna test, see how it's thick the consistency see that that's what you want nice you see that nice yellow color you can see the edge here nice um yellow color on the spoon now i'm gonna turn down the stove let me turn this down just a little bit more don't want it don't, don't want it to dry out too much so how you're gonna we're gonna test we're gonna test the the Irish that I put in to steam, to, to cook down, see? The fork, the fork went right through it. Fork can go right through. See, and I make sure that I immerse them at the bottom. So see? Once I, I dip the fork in it, see? Went right through it, so we know that the curry is finished. You know the curry is ready. Ready for service, ready for eating. Anybody want dinner? <laughs> Yes, you can come on over. 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 Yes, curry is ready. Curry is ready and nice. Curry is ready and nice. Ready to go. Mm -hmm. Steam down. You can see. 
cut that you can see that it is well cooked see easily cooked you can see it nice and ready now curry is ready to serve ready to serve with my rice and peas and my blended my blended juice mm -mm -mm. now i can turn off the stove and let the the, 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 the eat continue to cook whatever you don't have to take it off of the of the eating section of the stove just leave it right there right amount of curry right amount of eat i tasted it right amount it's not too hot you don't want to make the, the curry too hot whereas you, you can't taste the flavor too much all you're eating is tasting is only pepper pepper no you want the right amount of pepper see there you go jamaican curry nicely cooked and ready to serve thank you for watching stay tuned for more information on my channel see you soon